Hey everyone, today I wanted to do some things I'm loving for October and um, give you guys some ideas on some products you can buy and um, yeah, some things I'm really liking. And um, just so you guys know, I went to Ulta. I've been at work for 12 hours, so anyway, I decided to treat myself and I went to Ulta and uh, I tried, sorry, it sounded like someone was knocking. Um, I tried the Anastasia Brow Gel and that's clear and it's flaking after 20 minutes. It's disgusting. I really hate this product. It's 20 some dollars. Don't buy it, please. <laughs> it made my eyebrows really bushy looking, which was kind of cool, but um, yeah, within 20 minutes, it's flaking. So, not a good product. Pass. But anyway, back to the things I'm loving. Um, first thing I want to talk about, of course, is my nails. I don't know if you guys can see, but I'm wearing Fortune Teller from China Glaze, and it's a black with orange fleek glitter in it. And, um, Pink Lipstick actually suggested this product to me. I'm so glad she did, because I love it. It's so me. It's so wonderful. It's so Halloween. It's Halloween in a bottle, literally. So, um, after one day, look at how many chips I already have. Um, it's really kind of... It's a China Glaze nail polish, and China Glaze always chips on me like crazy. It hasn't chipped on my toes, and I've had it on my toes for two weeks, but nothing ever chips on my toes. So, um, but yeah, I, I have been using this ever since I bought it. I love it to death, uh, so I'm going to be sad when Halloween's over. But look at that. Love it. I wanted to get Spellbound, but I can't seem to find it anywhere, except for this one website. But it's really expensive. I just want to find it for, like six bucks or something but look at that I love it it's not as big and flaky as the NFUO that I've talked to you guys about which is oh, amazing but um yeah love it okay so next um, next thing I'm loving nail polish related uh, rapid dry top coat from OPI love this this is best ever I was using such a beat and um, I didn't realize it had all the bad ingredients in it that are bad for you, um, formaldehyde and all that, tooling. So I do not recommend that at all. I don't care how fast drying it is. This is great. Within two minutes, your nails are dry and you're ready to go. And you can do whatever you want and it won't smudge. And it's just the best top coat I've used. Next thing would be from Zoya. Uh, this color is an uh, Malia. Oh. My camera sucks, so you probably can't read it. <laughs> but let me show you guys what the color looks like. It's a nice fall purple color. It's a cream. I don't know how well you can see, but oh. Put it on some toilet paper. So you can kind of see the color. But it is amazing. I love it. Great for the fall. Beautiful purple. Very nice pastel, and it could also be for spring too, which is why I really like this color. It's kind of a spring and fall color. Okay, next is also from Zoya. Um, it's called Loredana, and it's a matte. They have some newer mattes for like the winter matte collection. Awesome, I want them so bad. But until then, um, this is a nice silvery uh, charcoal gray. It looks kind of like cement, and these are very fast drying. Two coats, you're ready to go bad part is these chip like crazy. I recommend a base coat and a top coat. It will make it slightly more shiny, but with this gray color, it's not going to matter. Like, it's not going to make it that much more shiny. I That's how I wear it anyway, because I can't stand to have chipping nail polish. It really grosses me out. But um, as you can see, it's just a nice gray silver. Perfect for fall. I love it. And the next product is Avalon Organics Vitamin C Lip Balm. I've actually used this for years, but it's so expensive. It's like 5 or $6 at the place that I go to. So I found a site, well somebody gave me this site, it's called Vitacost.com. And I'm going to put a link in the sidebar. And they have everything for like half off that I normally pay. So I'm just so happy. Thank you so much for telling me about this site. Um, and anyway, I love this vitamin C lip balm. It's better than anything I've ever tried. And it smells like oranges. Like really just this nice organic orange smell. So um, I use this before bed and just whenever my lips feel dehydrated. Next product would be the Alba Hibiscus Facial Toner. 
this is actually a really nice facial toner. It it has a slight warming sensation when you put it on. I was kind of freaked out at first because I have such sensitive skin. But it actually feels really good. Um, and it smells really nice. It's kind of like this herbally smell. And it's just really, really great. I love it. Um, and I just use it before bed every night. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I love it. It's awesome. I also got this at Vitacost.com for half off what I normally pay. So, awesome. Next thing would be Victoria's Secret Antibacterial Hand Wipes. This is in Love Swell, which I love that smell. But um, I love these hand wipes because they're so convenient. They fit so nicely in my purse and they smell awesome and they work and it's great. So, if you're kind of paranoid about germs, these are awesome. Next thing would be the MAC Face and Body Foundation. I know you guys want a product review, so I'm not going to go too much into depth about this. I'm actually going to do a full product review on this. I love this foundation. It is my favorite foundation ever. <laughs> I'm not wearing it right now, but I love it. It seriously is awesome. It's become my everyday foundation. Um, the only thing with this is that it's incredibly difficult to get out of your brushes. But I'll talk about that in another video. Um, not good for oily skin. I have very dry skin. But if you had oily skin, it kind of makes you really dewy. So if you have oil, you might not like that because you're tired of looking oily. <laughs> but I really love it. So, And you look amazing in photos. It's really great. Next product would be the Biolage Complete Control Hairspray in Medium. And this is an awesome hairspray like it just volumizes very light it doesn't make your hair crispy and that's something that really bothers me about hairspray this doesn't do that and it smells amazing so yay raw for that I purchased that at Ulta uh, they had buy to get to free awesome deal so I loaded up on Biolage and I have so many products now and the last product I want to talk about will be the Hocus Focus Face Kit from MAC. Um, this is an awesome, awesome kit. I've talked about it in my Magic Martha Mischief video, but I had somebody ask for like a product review on it, so I'm just going to kind of like go over it. Um, amazing. I'm actually wearing it right now, and I'll apply it heavier so you guys can see. This is the blush, and it's got a slight peachy tint to it, and I'm just really loading it on so you guys can see. This is the highlight. The highlight is awesome because it's not shimmery, like, overly shimmery. It's just nice and subtle. And you can actually put this all over your face to kind of highlight. And then, of course, the beauty powders. We all know how I feel about the beauty powders. Um, great for blending. Um, I use a kabuki and just work it. And it's, <laughs> it's amazing. So get this product if um, you want a, a good deal because it's it's only like $38 or something. Um, definitely worth it. I love this product. So, And that's pretty much it of the things I'm loving. Um, I did have a chance to try the uh, Hard Candy Concealer Palette. Um, I'm kind of disappointed in it. <laughs> I don't know what I expected for $8. Um, it, it's okay for a little bit of the dark circles, but it really doesn't cover them as well as I'd like them to. Um, it also breaks me out like when I put it right here and anywhere else besides under my eyes. So I have to say this is a no-go. Sorry guys. It's And then I tried to contour with it a little bit. It, the color's too orangey on my skin tone. So because um, I got the medium by accident if you remember. So I don't, I don't recommend this. Sorry. It's eight dollars. Save your money. And that is all. I know I'm really like hyped up for some reason. I think it's the caffeine. Um, I will talk to you guys later and we'll have lots more videos on the way. Okay, bye.